Hi, my name is Debbie Rodriguez and I work for the Detroit Zoological Society and today we'll be reading The Snow Bear by Miriam Moss, illustrated by Maggie Keaton. In the silent forest is a clearing where soft snowflakes fall. But listen, there's padding and pouncing and a snowdrift shivers. A little white bear bursts into the clearing. He looks left and right, high and low for his mother. Mother, where are you? calls the little white bear. He waits and waits, but she does not come. I will make a snow mother, he whispers, to keep me company while I wait. The little white bear sweeps snow into a mother's shape. But listen, there's snuffling and swishing and a deep crunch of snow. Musk ox shakes his shaggy coat. Let me help, he says and he heaves a heavy amount of snow with his strong shoulder. There's stirring and whirring and a soft snowy landing. Snow Goose smooths his fine feathers. Let me help, she says, and she pats down the snow with her wide webbed feet. There's splintering and splashing coming from the icy lake. Moose nuzzles the little white cub with his velvet muzzle. Let me help, he says, and he shovels more snow with his sweeping antlers. There's skidding and sliding and the sound of claws on ice. Fox twitches her frisky whiskers. Let me help, she says, and she shapes the feet with her quick curved claws. There's panting and pawing and a lot of tail wagging. Wolf sniffs the air with his long, sharp nose. Let me help, he says, and he brushes in the fur marks with his big, bushy tail. There's hopping and stopping and two long ears flopping. Hare stares with dark, liquid eyes. Let me help, she says, and she draws the face with her neat, narrow paws. Bear, hare, and wolf, snow, goose, and moose, musk, ox, and fox, finish the snow bear just as the sun sets and the world is washed gold. But listen, from the forest, their mothers call them home, all except for the little white bears. Goodbye, he says sadly as they disappear into the dusk. Thank you for your help. Darkness settles over the clearing. The little white cub snuggles up against the snow bear, wishing it was already morning. As he sleeps, warm winds blow from the south and soften the snow. Slowly, slowly, the snow bear melts into the green of the forest. But listen, as dawn breaks, who comes sniffing and searching through the trees? In the clearing, a new day begins. A familiar scent awakens the little white bear. He blinks sleepily. It's you, he murmurs, moving closer to his mother's side. I knew you would find me. And that was the snow bear. Join us at the Detroit Zoo and take a walk through the Arctic Ring of Life and visit the polar bears. Keep reading.